what's up guys we are back with another auto auction update man we are back at the auction where we can't open anything unfortunately man but they do got a bunch of nice cars here and over there man we got some cars that don't run some that do if you haven't already please like comment and subscribe to the channel let's check these cars out man so we got a 2012 infinity g25 it's not the 35 it is the uh i guess the base model it does have some giovanna 20 inch rims on that joint and it looks like all the rims are matching with matching which is a plus oh damn i was just about to y'all see me reaching for it Ooh, i caught myself oh man if we take a look at the inside it does have like that beige leather interior everything in there looks to be intact for the most part um man i was so close to opening that door yeah, all four rims match, so that's a plus too, man. I think this thing will go for a pretty decent price here today. I wouldn't mind grabbing an Infinity. What you guys think about it? It's got the sunroof and the smog. Let me know what you think about it in the comments below. We got an 06 Mercedes E350 here, 166,000 miles, man. And they try to tuck this Benz in the cut, so it may be something wrong with it. Or one of the guys is holding it for air buddies, but usually this type of stuff will be on that other end. So I don't know if it's something wrong with this one or not, but it does have some black interior, leather interior. It's pretty whooped in there. It's really, really dirty. Definitely gonna need a full on detail. Um, it's the E350. It's got some a gapage right there. It looks like some tape is holding the trunk together. So yeah, it's your, this one, you're gonna need some work on this one. But it may go pretty cheap, though. I'm not really sure. It doesn't have the uh, sunroof, so that tells me this isn't the highest um, model of this, you know, model, if you get me. What y'all think about the Mercedes, man? Let me know in the comments below. Alrighty, guys. We got a 2010 Nissan Altima here. 148,000 miles on the dash. Uh, first glance, we do got some slight tequila kickage there. We do have mixed match wheels. Uh, we got the sunroof on this one. It does look like uh, this bumper and stuff has been painted it's like two different blues. Um, 148,000 miles. I mean, it's pretty cool for an Altima. And the inside does have some nice black leather. So you're probably just going to have to find that one wheel and get that little fender pulled out, if you will. But all in all, it does look pretty fair. 148,000 miles, man. What do you guys think about it? Let me know in the comments below. Alrighty, guys. Next up, man, we got a 09 Volkswagen Jetta here, 129,000 miles, man. Pretty good looking Jetta here, if you ask me. And the mileage is fairly, fairly decent. If we take a walk around this way, it doesn't have any body damage or anything like that, so that's a plus. Pretty decent little car here. Nothing that really stands out. If we look in the inside, it does have that black cloth interior, which is pretty fair. I don't see any rips or any tears in the seat so that's a plus this may be one of the best buys of the day here as well because these things are pretty reliable if you take care of them so we'll see what they uh want for this man what do you guys think it'll go for let me know in comments below we got a 05 dodge durango here 157,000 miles man pretty good looking truck it's got the big mini tires on deck with the armor roll okay so they tried to make this one look good you're gonna need some headlight restoration got a little bit of paint fading there pretty nice like lifted up truck we could take a quick look at the inside it does have like gray leather interior which is pretty cool as well back got some meaty tires as well you do got the tow hitch so you can hook up the boats or the jet skis you know summer's approaching so man you already know how we do summer man but what y'all think about it man let me know in the comments below Alrighty, guys, we got a 07 Nissan Moreno here, 153,000 miles. However, it does have a salvage title. Um, we can check really quick if it has like a salvage because of a wreck, but the tires are like really bald and dry rotted. Man, this thing is filthy, dog. Seats, black leather interior. Inside of that look pretty whooped if you ask me. Uh, 
might have been oh yeah it was definitely repaired right here in this quarter panel they bondoed it up because the bondo is starting to crack there but 07 nissan marino 153,000 miles i'm sure it's probably going to go for like four or five hundred bucks today which i think about it man let me know in the comments below and this is the car that they're raffling today for 30 bucks it looks like a 03 or 04 bmw 325 registered to march 2020 california plates black leather interior inside that joint and eh, it's all right i'd pay 30 bucks for it but i'd have to win it man it's got the sunroof so that's cool we've got a couple other cars over here that we're not going to go in too much into detail but you guys just see oh this is a pretty cool one which one is this one number three we got a 2010 chevy aveo 61,000 miles this is probably one that's going to be hitting in the uh hidden today i mean they're gonna look at this thing and not think it's as new as it is the inside is pretty cool it does have some stains on the seat nothing too crazy though can be detailed out pretty good Sixty-six thousand miles i think you guys this might be one of the goodbyes of today excuse me yeah oh no you're fine <laughs> pretty good looking car what y'all think about it, man? Let me know in the comments below. We got a few more cars back here. Stuff that we're not gonna really bid on. You got the Envoy, little Ford, Cobalt. I think this one might have been here uh, last week and they didn't come pick it up. So that might tells me that something might be wrong with this one. Cause it looked good last week, honestly, when I was uh, looking at it. But none of these cars back here run, so you might be able to get this one, this truck right here with the motor. I'm not sure if it uh, cranks over or not. They got this super, wow. They got the Lakers interior on this bad boy, man. We got an 01 Lexus IS300 here, man. This is definitely the purple and gold machine, man. This might've been Snoop Dogg car. The Laker. The Laker interior, all purple and yellow. Man, they was die hard Laker fan. That's pretty dope. I wish I can open this door for you real quick. That would be pretty sick. I mean, I like the idea. It's got some Sebring tuning exhaust on that joint. Pretty cool looking whip. Snow running. Pretty cool looking whips though. We got a Ram 1500 with a bunch of junk in the back. And I'll just show you everything that we didn't even really show you just yet that you might have missed. Got a little Nissan Versa here. What year is this? What is this? A 2010 Nissan Versa. 139,000 miles. That's pretty fair. This one's going to be a seller today. Super tinted up windows. The inside actually looks really good. It's super tinted, so you guys can't see it, but take my word for it. I think that's legit. We got a couple of other cars here. They still got this Lancer here from last week. Super wood like they used this in the Fast and Furious for a stunt double car. Who really knows? And I think it's a, uh, it's a truck. Or, I got the Mustang. I got the Mustang GT. Not really a fan of it. got the little Yukon, man. So, alrighty, guys. That's going to be a wrap for today's video, man. If you haven't already, please like, comment, and subscribe to the channel, man. If you're wondering what any of these cars went for, 
Uh, tune in tomorrow as that video will be out first thing in the morning, man. Until next time, guys, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.